time. So yeah, today we're going to be making an alien shooter game. So what do I mean by alien shooter game? Well, basically your mouse is a type of, how to call it, like, when you look through a gun, you see like this little pointer. So your the hand, so your mouse is that. And then you can point at any ghost and just shoot it. So, how do you do that? So firstly, I'm just going to take a gun cross here. Transparent. Search for a gun, uh, a gun crosshair. Nope. I'm just gonna take this one. Or you could draw your own one, which I'm not saying you can't. I just want to take something that has already been made. I'm just done with that. Okay, so now we have it. And now let's actually start creating our game. So firstly, try to upload it, and then scroll down and select the clip art. I select uh, the crosshair. I mean, when I say clip art, it was called like that. So then resize it to the size that you want. So I'm going to just make mine about this size, yeah. So now, delete the cat and do a, and here, go to one fly clicked forever, go to, uh, go to, go to, mouse pointer. Now, as you can see, it always follows your mouse pointer, wherever you are on the screen. So it's just a little simple line of code just to start that off. Now I'm just going to take make a spooky backdrop. Should, I, hmm. Should we draw one? Actually, firstly, just draw, draw your enemies. So, I'm just gonna draw. Uh, I'm gonna draw. So, since Halloween just passed, just came recently, oh, that's why I thought to make a spooky game. So, I'm just gonna make a bean. Yes. Bean. And I'm just gonna make it a little gray. And I'm gonna turn it into a ghost. It looks like the bean has a dress. The bean looking kind. The bean. The bean is looking kind of well dressed. I'm happy for the bean. It has a sense of fashion. Good job, bean. We all knew you. We all knew you could dress well. Everyone doubted you. I'm just gonna make that bigger. And said it's cold and empty, no one's around to judge me. I can see clearly when you're gone. Uh -huh. and I said, Ooh, I'm blind. Okay, so now we have our sh outline, I guess. No, the shape of a ghost. So now we'll give, give it some eyes. I'm not gonna make it cute, I'm gonna give it some. You could draw a cute ghost. I don't want to draw a cute ghost. Why did it... Okay. No, I don't want to select that. Don't want to select that. Okay, now. Let's take black. Take that. And I'm going to take red. It looks like it's going to ultra kill you. Okay. So now the ghost just sits there and can basically do nothing. But we don't want that. We want the ghost to be an actual enemy. 
we also want to add a variable. So call the variable health. Then do all one flag clicked. Set health to set to how much your health will be. I'm gonna set it around 100. Oh, and also set the cross here to go to front layer. Just, just more comfortable. You don't want the crosshair to be under the ghost. So now, as you can see, we can we can just do nothing. The crosshair is there. The ghost is there. We have our health, but basically doing nothing. But now, do a make a variable called ghost show. So now do a one flag clicked set ghost show to true. Okay. And then do a just wait then I'm gonna take that away. Do a forever if then Oh and also make a variable called ghost health. I didn't uh, I didn't do that yet. So ghost health so now do a one fly clicked forever if then take an add take a touching mouse pointer and mouse down forever if touching mouse pointer and the mouse is down then firstly what we want to do is to change health by minus by actually uh, so we have to do a set ghost health I'm going to set it to 50. Then change ghost health by minus 5. So now, as you can see, we do that. And oh. Oh, because I did a set. Sorry. Uh, make a, Take it a change ghost health by minus 5. And we also got to do unfold it forever go to front layer and now as you can see uh, so actually do here do a uh, wait to 0 0.1 wait 0 0.5 seconds because uh, it's taking two you could just spam it so now as you can see I'm just gonna uh, change it to 0 0.2. I think 0 0.2 is gonna be a good number. Let's, see, let's try. Now, as you can see, we can't actually spam it. So that's way better. So now we'll do hide the ghost ghost show because we don't want the ghost to show. And then do a so and then uh and then put a hide in here. And I'll actually put a broadcast broadcast hide one because we don't want it to hide in this script hide one so hide one is the first time it'll hide so now put a when i receive hide one then hide so now as you can see he hides okay so then wait 0 0.1 wait uh, 0 point just wait one second and then go to random position. Go to random position. Then just do that. Oh, right, and do a one flag click to show. I'm sorry, uh, put that also in here. Show. No, put that here. There we go. One flag clicked, show. Okay, so now as you can see, go shoot the ghost.
Tell me in a virtual random position. So that's just simple. It's really just an easy, quick uh, game that that you can just do to set, put off some steam. And right there. But as you can see, it still goes. So now do a uh, Uh, one flag clicked forever. If then, if health, uh, I mean uh, ghost health, equals, to also take an or, it's important. Or, but then, ghost health equals. equals if ghost health uh, per if, if go ghost health equals zero or if ghost health or if ghost health is smaller than zero. Smaller than ghost health is smaller than zero. Then do a forever hide. Then do a stop. Then actually do stop other scripts in this sprite. Or stop with their scripts. There we go. So, actually, no. Yes. Yeah, and then stop all. So, now as you can see, we can actually shoot the ghost. It's just an easy little game uh, to just, you know, have fun playing. It's not hard. And, uh, yeah, so next episode, what we're going to be doing is we're going to let the zombie actually be, uh, the ghost, I mean, let the ghost be able to kill us. And, yeah, see you guys next time.